Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. So today we have another inventory video. However, slightly different to the other ones. This is the ultimate yellow themed inventory. Now, if you've seen any of my other inventory videos, you'll know they have a cheap tier, mid tier, expensive tier. However, for this one, just one set of skins, no individual tiers. This is the best inventory. So the best skins for one solid inventory now the prices for these skins have been taken from d market because as always it's just a site i use personally not sponsored but uh link in the description please sponsor me love you Mwah. obviously you might be able to find the prices cheaper somewhere else it might even some of them might even be cheaper on the actual steam site or steam market which is very unlikely but it's possible so starting off with the pistols we have the glock 18 brass in minimal wear which is 23 now some of these skins are very expensive some are very cheap some are medium it's a mixture of prices hence the ultimate inventory it's just the best skins for that weapon so for the usps we have the jawbreaker in minimal wear which is the first cs2 skin from the kilowatt collection which is 35 pound and then we've got the deagle bronze deco and factory new which is 40p nice and cheap lovely everyone can afford that then we've got the bretta's marina in minimal wear which is for and then we've got the p250 wing shot in factory new which is three pounds 30 and then the tech 9 fuel injector in minimal oil, which is four pounds and then we've got the five seven monkey business which is one pound 50 for field tested now you might be thinking if it's the ultimate inventory why is every skin not factory new and that's because i wanted to keep it as affordable as possible like it's, it's still expensive as our, an entire inventory but i wanted to to keep it still budget friendly because if i go factory new everything some skins right the difference between minimal wear and factory new is humongous like a factory new skin for some skins i can't think of one on top of my head but it could be 200 pound let's say then a minimal wear one could be 30 40 pounds you know big there's a big difference there it's a couple hundred pound difference there so you know we, we go for the more affordable version and it still looks as good because it's minimal wear right so moving on to the smgs kicking it off with the mac 10 we have the stalker in factory new which is 46 pounds 80 now that's a lot for a mac 10 but it does look pretty decent and then for the mp7 we've got the akaben in factory new as well but it's only 30p See what I mean? Some some skins are extremely expensive, some aren't. It's fine. For the MP9, we have the Bulldozer and Field Tested, which is £50. Now, I believe if I know my prices correctly, the Minimal Wear and Factory New, the Bulldozer goes for over like £200. So, the Field Tested it is. And then for the UMP45, we have the Blaze and Factory New for £13. And then for the P90, we have the Scarab Rush in Factory New for £10.40. Now, I think the Anubis collection is probably one of the best ones that we've had in recent years. Because, uh, I don't know, I just think the skins all look good. You've got the Eye of Horus. No one ever has it because it's fucking extremely, ridiculously, unnecessarily rare. Every skin in the Anubis collection is sick. And then to finish off the SMGs, we have the PP Bison Judgment of Anubis in Minimal Wear for £5. Now, I know... The Judgment of Anubis only has a little bit of yellow and it's mainly black. I'm pretty sure there's more red on it than yellow. But that's just because there's no other version or option to go for. So if you can find a better skin, let me know in the comments. Like, just... But I couldn't find anything. So moving on to the rifles. Out of all of the inventory videos I've done, probably the best looking version of rifles we have got the AK-47 Fuel Injector Minimal Wear for £175. Now, again, I don't like the Fuel Injector, but for Yolo, you have to say which one's the best, and this is, unfortunately, the best. And for the M4A4, we have the Buzzkill in Factory Newt, which is £20, which kind of looks like the Fuel Injector, if you look, if you think about it just a little bit. It's a little bit different, but it look, it's, like, it's like different but the same. You know what I'm saying? And then for the M4A1S, we have the Chantico's Fire in Minimal Wear, which is £35. Now, I also included this in the red inventory video. So if you're going for like a hybrid inventory and or you just want multiple sets of skins for different colours, you could use this for both red and yellow. So that saves you a nice little penny for the M4. Then for the FAMAS, we've got the Commemoration in Factory New, which is £13. 
And then for the org, we've got the torque in minimal, which is £5.70. Now, similarly to the judgment of Anubis, there's not a whole lot of yellow on this, but it's the most amount of yellow compared to any other skin for the org. So, and then for the Galil, we've got the Cerberus in field tested, which is 1450. And then again, for the orb, we've got the wildfire in minimal which is 60 pounds. Again, same as the red inventory. Now there is one orb you could go for that is actually yellow, but no one can afford it because it's, um, I think you know what I'm talking about. It's the dragon law. That is not just something your average CS player is going to be able to have, you know, that that's, that's rich man territory. So if you're a rich boy watching this, buy yourself one of those, um, Buy me one, please. Thank you. If there are any other yellow skins for an AWP or more yellow skins that are in the same price range as a wildfire, let everyone know so uh, they can use that instead. Then to finish off the rifles, we have the SSG Big Iron and Minimal Wear, which is eight pounds. Now, if you've seen my best knife and glove combo videos, this knife and glove combo was in it. And I still personally think it's the best looking combo. I don't like yellow that much, but this combo is mwah, it's beautiful now we have a talent knife tiger tooth factory new and we're pairing that with sports gloves omega field tested but you want them to be below a 0.2 float so like a high field tested basically close to minimal wear so for the knife it's 495 pounds and then for the gloves is 460 pounds so the majority of the total is the knife and gloves the knife and gloves come to about 955 ish and the total for everything including the knife and gloves is 1482 pounds and 90p so whack off a grand this entire inventory is under 500 pound which isn't that bad for the entire inventory minus knife and gloves so that has been the inventory video if you have any other versions of yellow skins that could be used as well as of skins that i haven't mentioned or skins that you prefer like say there's another ak skin that's yellow that you prefer or whatever let me know in the comments so everyone else can see what other options there are let me know what other knife and glove combos you would also use because obviously this is quite an expensive one so you can let people know any uh budget friendly ones as well if that's what you're going for and also let me know what color you would like next i've got green on the list purple or white chrome sort of theme or whatever i don't i don't, I don't know let me know just let me know what you'd like and yeah i shall see you in the next one bye